fan, what's up everybody, it's your boy Microphone Man, I'm back again with another video this time, it's uh, Red Dead Redemption 2, so, I said, I said fuck getting Spider-Man, cause you know, my big brother, he already had it and stuff, and I've been seeing a lot of gameplay of it, oh, shout out to MK Fire and Ice, man, I fuck with his little walkthrough videos, man, like, his shit's just the shit, but, um, yeah man so i just got this red dead redemption 2 you know what i'm saying like i'm really excited but i'm, I'm kind of scared but you know i'm really excited to see to see what's going down you know with the game and whatnot but um you know like i always say man we're gonna um i'm saying like i always say like i've been really been on this shit but um you know what I'm saying? We're gonna try to keep it cool, keep it calm, keep it cordial, you know what I'm saying? Just play the game. Um anybody out there, y'all wanna see me do this all the way through, man, let me know, man. I don't got time like that, cause like I said, you know what I'm saying? I'm a I'm a young cat with a life, but um Yeah, man, like any of y'all wanna see me like play the game all the way through, let me know and I might um uh, I might fuck with y'all, man. I might um try to Broadcast it live or some shit. I don't know. I don't know how to do all this newfangled shit, man. But um, yeah, man. Like we just gonna get into it. Abigail says he's dying, Dutch. We'll have to stop someplace. Okay. Arthur's out looking. I sent him up ahead. Uh. If we don't stop soon, we'll all be dying. This weather, it's May. I'm just hoping the law got as lost as we did. There. Arthur! Any luck? I found a place where we can get some shelter. Let Davy rest while he, you know, an old man in town. 
Bandits, it ain't far. Come on. Come on! Yeah! Bring him in here! <coughs> Miss Gaskell, get that fire lit, quick. Miss Jones, bring in whatever blankets we have. Mr. Pearson, see what we've got in terms of food. Davy's dead. There was nothing more you could have done. What are we gonna do? We need supplies. Well, first of all, you're gonna stay here, and you were gonna get yourself warm. Now, I sent John and Mike scouting out ahead. Arthur and I, we're gonna ride out, see if we can find one of them. And this? Just for a short bit. And I don't see what other choice we have. Listen. Listen to me, all of you, for a moment. Now, we've had, well, a bad couple of days. I loved Davy, Jenny, Sean, Mac. They may be okay. We don't know. But we lost some folks. Now, if I could throw myself in the ground, in their stead, I'd do it, gladly. But we are going to ride out, and we are going to find some food. Everybody, we're safe now. There ain't nobody following us through a storm like this one. And by the time they get here, well, we're going to be, we're going to be long gone. We've been through worse than this before. Mr. Pierce, Miss Grimshaw, I need you to turn this place into a camp. We may be here for a few days. Now, all of you, all of you, get yourselves warm. Stay strong. Stay with me. We ain't done yet. Come on, Arthur. All right. We've got some work well, to do. We ain't run into them yet. So, they both must have headed down the hill. Sure. Hey, I ain't had time to ask. What really went down back there on that boat? We missed you. That's what happened. Come on. Uh, oh. Hey, you need horses? Oh, yeah. Hey, Mr. Smith. Get yourself indoors. You need to rest that hand. I'll live. Get indoors, son. Uh, we need you strong. Okay. Come on, let's go. Ain't sure what we're gonna find out here, Dutch. We have to try. Stay close. We'll do our best to stick to the trail. This goddamn weather. Been two days or more like this now. Oh, it has to blow over soon. Be careful over this bridge here. Who 
Move up alongside me. Can't see you back there. Can't believe we lost Davy, too. He's the last one, Arthur. No more. We need to get those people warm and fed. At least we don't need to worry about Pinkerton's tailing us in this. Uh, a couple more days, we'll be on the other side. You need to help me pick the others back up. You're the only one I can rely on to stay strong right now. We got a fire and shelter. That's a start. So, do you think it was a trap in Blackwater? That many men? Oh, they knew we were coming. But there was money on that boat, all right. Lots of it. Hey. I think I see something up the path. Oh. You up ahead. Who's there? Micah. Gentlemen. Found anything? I think so. Found a little homestead down that way. Okay. Anyone home? Sure. Place is blazing with light and noise. Sounded like a party. Let's go see. Follow me. <clears throat> How's Davy doing? Uh, he didn't make it. Nor did little Jenny. That's too bad. Davy was a real fighter. Both of them calendar boys is. Or <laughs> was. Yeah. And Mac, Sean, we don't know. Quite a business. I'm glad you're all right, Micah. Always. Ask him if he's seen John. Hey, have you seen John, Micah? Didn't see much of anything once this storm came in. He hasn't seen him. He'll be fine. Things always turn out right for that boy. I hope. Mac and Sean are still out there somewhere, too. Move up, Arthur. I'll cover the rear. Hey! You sure about this, Micah? Mr. Morgan, I never thought I would be so pleased to see your face. Been kind of lonely out here. Where's everyone else? Old mining camp, back up the hill. Huddled around a fire, waiting for Daddy to put food on the table. Said it before, we got too many mouths to feed. Well, we got a few less now, so you should be happy. That ain't fair, Arthur. I earn my share. You think it's unreasonable to expect others to do the same? So, this house... You speak to the people there already? No. Like Dutch told us, look, but don't talk to no one. Just following orders. You know me. I'm a good boy. Right. How much further? Not far. What does that mean? Not far. Mm, thanks. Okay. Let's keep it down now, gentlemen. It's just up ahead. Snuff and stash those lanterns, boys. Best you two lie low on this. Okay. Let's head down there. Let's hitch up here. Talk. 
We don't want to scare these folks. Sounds like quite the party. You two, get yourself out of sight. One lonely man is a lot less intimidating than three nasty-looking degenerates. Arthur, what are you doing? I said get out of sight. Arthur, take cover in that shed over there. Trying to figure out what fucking shit he talking about. I guess it's this one. Right? What's up, bro? It's the shit, ain't it? Okay, which fucking shit? Oh, you want me right here? Hey, bro, need to be more specific, man. But I like how they don't have like a whole lot of shit, like taking you out the experience and shit, like. Whole bunch of motherfucking thing. Let's see what's gonna pop off. Hello. Shut up, Billy. Excuse me. Hello. Oh, well. Hello, friend. What you want? I am very sorry to disturb you. Uh, my friends and I. Well, we got into some trouble up the way. Lost in the storm. Ah, uh, gentlemen. <laughs> we can't help you, mister. I got folks, Arthur, dying on the trail. Arthur, we got a problem. <laughs> folks. There's a corpse right here. No, I, I just Arthur, need some There's a body of food in the wagon. Or I hear you. Just gentlemen. keep your eyes <laughs> upside down grab as many supplies as you can we need the essentials food medicine whiskey uh, I'm starving you should eat something now get your strength up for the ride back There's a big price on Colm O'Driscoll's head. Nearly as big as the one on yours. Wanting Colm dead is about the only thing me and Uncle Sam agree on. Big old pool of blood on the floor here. I saw. Probably the poor bastard who lived here. Micah found a dead body in the wagon outside. Place is dry and warm. We could maybe move the women and Jack down here. Maybe. We'll see how they are when we get back. I don't really want us to split up. Huh. Oh. 
looks like the poor bastard was married too. At some point. If we can't eat it or drink it, put it down. Keep searching while I pack these on the horses. Meet me out here when you're done. Micah, Arthur, keep looking for stuff. Arthur, go see if there's anything in that barn. Micah, you search the cabin, see what we missed. Sure. here, near the lake. What are you bastards doing? Why are you up here? Uh, we're fixing to rob some train. Gonna blow the tracks. No, I don't know more than that, I swear. <laughs> well, I would say it looks like you have this, Arthur. Do what you want with him. I don't care. But bring that horse when you're done. Whoa. I don't know anything else. Please. Please. Still in there? He's dealt with. Good. 
That looks like a decent horse. You should keep him. Get that horse itch. Don't want him bolting. with us. Arthur. Yes. It's okay. Uh, we're bad men. We ain't them. No. It's okay. Get on. We'll keep you safe until you figure out what you want to do. What's your name, miss? Miss. Adler. Adler. Sadie Adler. Mrs. I... He... He was my husband. It's fucking amazing so far. Cole cool. O'Driscoll and his scum, they beat us to it. We found some of them there, but there is more about them. Apparently, scouting the train. Thank you. That's the last thing we need right now, Judge. Well, it is what it is. But we found some supplies, some blankets, a little bit of food, and this poor soul, Mrs. Adler, Miss Tilly, Miss Karen, would you warm her up? Give her a drink or something. And Mrs. Adler, it's gonna be okay. You're safe now. They turned her into a widow. Animals. I need some rest. I haven't slept in three days. You're over here. Miss O'Shea will show you the way. Mr. Morgan, we put you in a room over here. Thank you, Miss Grimshaw. Mr. Bell, you're with the fellas over there. What? How come Arthur gets a room and I get a bunk bed next to Bill Williamson and a bunch of darkies? Get yourself to bed. Did this nigga just say what I think he said? I forgot it was that kind of time. But... Shit. He ain't been seen in days. Whether it let up. He's strong. And he's smart. Strong, at least. Hello, Arthur. Abigail. Arthur. How you doing? Just fine, Abigail. And you? I need you to. I really I'm sorry. Like I'm sorry to ask. I really do. Little John. He's got himself caught to a scrape again. He ain't been seen in two. Two days. Your John will be fine. I mean, he may be as dumb as rocks and as dull as rusted iron, but that ain't changing because he got caught in some snowstorm. Please go take a look. Javier? Yes. Javier, will you ride out with Arthur <clears throat> to take a look for John? <clears throat> You're the two best fit men we've got. Now? She's... We're all... Yeah, we're pretty worried about him. I know... 
the situation were reversed, he'd look for me. Thank you. This way. Last I know, John was headed up the river. For all we know, he kept riding north and never looked back. He wouldn't leave. Not like that. Uh, wouldn't be the first time. Driscoll's boys. Well, it seems somebody left recently. And that way. Sure, well, come on then. I hope we get to see my nigga John Marston, man. First Red Dead was my shit, bro. I still play it to this day. Nigga got the uh, game of the year edition. You think it's John? You tell me. These are horse tracks for sure, but could be anyone. Let's just see where they lead. So you were there, Javier. What really happened on that boat? We had the money. It seemed fine. And suddenly they were everywhere. Bounty hunters? No, Pinkerton. It was crazy. Raining bullets. Watch out for this crevice. Dutch killed a girl in a bad way. But it was a bad situation. That ain't like him, though. Tracks go left, down here. Davy got shot. Mac and John, both shot too. Sean, we don't even know. I'm surprised we escaped at all. By the time you boys showed up from the other side of town, we were only just holding on. Bad business, all right. Whoa. That snow's coming in hot again. We'll lose these tracks if we don't move fast. Yourself. It's not very wide here. Wrong trip. Come on, boy. Horses are getting tired. Yeah, a lot of fresh snow here. Uh, I don't know about this, Javier. But we can't follow nothing. Now let's push on a little bit. Maybe we'll pick up the trail again. Give me one second. It's 
coming from up ahead somewhere. I don't think we can go much further in the horses. We'll have to walk from here. I'd grab that shotgun from your horse. Who knows what's up ahead? Slippery, be careful. Mierda, that we're high up here. You're telling me. You sure about this? Over here! It's coming from this way. Okay. Watch out here. Watch your head here. Okay. Good now. Watch your stairs. It's real slippery. Stay close to the wall. Up here. Come on. a few days. I know. Here. Take a drink of this. Thanks. I'm not designed for this snow. Let's keep moving then. Come on. There's so much shit about this game that's amazing, like, I can't even comment on it. Alright, where, 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 where he at? Where, 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 John? I'm coming. you got there. Damn. Never thought I'd say this, but good to see you, Arthur Morgan. So I wonder what scratched his face. You don't look so good. I don't feel too good, neither. <clears throat> Freezing. <clears throat> don't die just yet, cowboy. We need some applause for this moment, bro. Let's try this way. Ain't you a sorry side? Can't argue with you there. Bro, I think I'm gonna end it right here. I need to enjoy this by my lonesome. Man, fuck with me if y'all wanna see some more gameplay of this, but I love this game too much to let y'all keep seeing me play it, bro. So, yeah, I'm gonna end it like right here, man.